You'll soon see even more workers starting to fill those pesky potholes around Colorado Springs, and they want to make it clear they do not use cheap materials. Now, new tonight, only Cardio News Channel 13 Scott Harrison is getting a look at what goes inside those potholes and how well it works. Melvin Dixon Jr. is proud of his classic car. 66 Ford Fairlane 500 convertible. Very nice. All original. But he's not happy about the pothole damage that happened. He can't understand why better fill materials aren't available. Well, I understand a lot of things are different, but I'm 62 years old and I know they had one type when I was a kid and it lasted because they didn't have all this new technology. Crews say asphalt is still the tried and true material. They prefer to do a longer lasting repair with hot asphalt during warm weather. They dig out around the pothole, blow it clean, fill it with 200 degree material, and use a roller to compact it. You know, we would expect that to last, uh, again, given proper conditions around it. Uh, we'd expect that to last a couple years. But crews can't spend that much time on every pothole. So, in colder, wetter weather and in emergencies, crews use a cold asphalt mix. The only tool needed is a shovel to scoop it out, fill the pothole, and pat it down. That could last months, uh, maybe even up to a year uh, or more. We've seen cold mix patches uh, last even longer, uh, but they're not expected to. Corey Farkas of the Streets Division says if you think this cold mix asphalt is cheap material, guess again. We're taking a shovel and trying to shovel some of this mix, and you can see it's hard to do because it's so dense. And Farkas says that's what it's designed to do, to be soft going into the pothole so that it will be durable and last once it's applied to the pothole. There's so many out there that if we don't start doing filling operations at some point and just getting mix in the hole, we will never catch up. Crews also fill concrete potholes similar to this one, but it's more expensive. Sometimes filling it with asphalt works, sometimes not. I mean, that's a whole, whole nother beast. Uh, concrete requires usually we have a fast set concrete material that we can put in the hole. Uh, it'll cure within like 45 minutes. But local crews will continue to rely on asphalt to smooth your driving and prevent vehicle damage. In Colorado Springs, Scott Harrison, KRDO News Channel 13. And drivers are counting on a 2C paving project scheduled to start Thursday to get rid of more potholes permanently.